Hello, girls and boys. Today we are going to do an experiment. Multicolor parachutes. That's our experiment. We will find out which parachute will fall first. Let me tell you first the materials you are going to need. Colored paper. Tape. Thread. Paper clips. Scissors. Let's see now what we will have to do. For this multicolor parachute experiment, you will have to take your colored paper and scissors and with the help of an adult, you will have to cut three big squares. After that, take the thread and cut 16 long pieces of the same length. Attach four strings of the thread with the tape onto each corner of each square. Now you will take the paper clips and you will attach them to the end of the four strings of thread. And it will look like this. So you will make three parachutes, one with one paper clip, the other one with three paper clips, and the third one with five paper clips. When your parachutes are ready, with the help of an adult, you will have to throw them in the air and you will have to find out which of the three parachutes falls first. So, for this experiment, today we will become scientists. And for that, we will have to follow five steps. Step number one, ask a question. Which parachute will fall first? The one with one paper clip? The one with three paper clips? Or the one with five paper clips? Step number two. Make a hypothesis or a prediction. As a scientist, before you start with the experiment, you have to write down your predictions. And a prediction is what do you think it will happen. And for that, you have to answer all the questions you did before. So now think and answer the questions. And check on the mark sheet your prediction. Step number three. Now you can conduct the experiment. Now it is time. Do the experiment so you can test your predictions. So, while you do the experiment, you have to follow step number four. On this step, you have to collect all the information from the experiment. 
and for that you will have to check on this mark sheet the results. For the step number five, you have to draw your conclusions. So compare your predictions with the results. Here, you will have to draw your conclusions comparing your predictions with the results of the experiment. Let's review the steps. Step number one, ask a question. Step number two, make a hypothesis or a prediction. Step number three, conduct the experiment. So, while you do the experiment, you have to follow step number four. On this step, you have to collect all the information from the experiment. For the step number five, you have to draw your conclusions. So compare your predictions with the results. When you're done with the experiment, you will have to complete this sheet to let us know if you like it. Before you start, let me tell you the materials you will need for next week. One Ziploc bag, pencils, and water. So now go and have fun being a scientist.